I want a lifetime with you. Chapter 1 Forever Love It was a late autumn day in Jungqing. Shnuan had just disembarked from her flight with her luggage in tow. She took a deep breath, taking in the long-lost, yet familiar scent. She had gone overseas to further her studies for a whole year as a representative of her company. And she was finally back now. When she thought about how it would be her third anniversary with Fu Xiching in three days, she worked around the clock to could come back earlier, hoping to give him a surprise. The woman quickly hailed a cab to Fu Xiching's company. When she walked in, Yu, the receptionist, looked at her in shock. You are back. Director Sh, are you here for the general manager's wedding? Shnuan frowned, perplexed by what you was saying. Your general manager's wedding. What are you talking about? You? The wedding between Mr. Fu and your sister. What did you say? Shnuan was shocked. Happiness fading from her expression. Whose wedding did you just say it was? You looked at Shnuan and soon realized she had said something she shouldn't have. She visibly gulped. The general manager and your sisters. Where is it held? J. Jinyi Hotel. Shnuan was thunderstruck. She turned on her heel and left the company. Take me to Jinyi Hotel. Please. Shnuan got out of the car at the main door of the hotel. Before she even entered. The woman saw a photo of them right outside the door. Fu Xiching was hugging Shui. Who was dressed in an elegant gown. They were looking at each other with love. Shnuan had been trying to comfort herself on her way to the hotel by saying Fu Xiching was her boyfriend. So it was impossible that he was engaged to her sister. However, reality was a harsh slap to her face. Once she entered, Shnuan saw Fu Xiching whispering something to Shui, making the latter blush. What she saw made her face turn red with rage. What a joke. My boyfriend of three years getting engaged to my sister while I was overseas. Shui was toasting the guests with Fu Xiching when she spotted her sister from the corner of her eye. Color drained from her face and she reflexively gripped Fu Xiching's arm tighter. Fu Xiching saw Shnuan too. But he was only stunned for a moment. He gave Shui a comforting smile before they walked up to Shnuan. Here to attend our wedding. Nuan. He sounded so gentle, but Shnuan felt like she had been stabbed with a knife. She said through gritted teeth, Your wedding? You cheated on me. Fu Xiching. Do you not feel sorry at all? And you? Shui. Are you really that thirsty for men and attention? You knew he's my boyfriend. So how dare you? You scum. Someone gave her a hard slap across the face. Shnuan held her throbbing cheek her eyes tearing up. Mom. Don't call me that. I don't have a daughter like you. Your sister is getting married today. And instead of blessing her, you come here and cause a riot. You are doing this on purpose. Aren't you? Jung Yu gnashed her teeth and glared at Shnuan. Shnuan's heart skipped to beat. What are you talking about? Mom. Fu Xiching's my boyfriend. What do you mean he's your boyfriend? He's your brother-in-law. Why do you have to fight with your sister over everything? You disappoint me. Ha ha. Shnuan suddenly let out a bark of laughter. She looked at her mother, who was twisting the facts. Before she looked at Fu Xiching. You tell her. Who's your girlfriend? Fu Xiching. Fu Xiching frowned, feeling flustered as he looked at Shnuan. But the grip on his arm sobered him up. Sorry, Nuan. But the person I love has always been your sister. Shnuan could feel her heart being shredded to pieces as Fu Xiching answered her calmly. Well, 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 this is just dandy. Ha! Huh. I dumped you. Fu Xiching. Not the other way around. Remember that. It took all Shnuan had to not go up there and tear them apart. I hope you spend the rest of your lives together forever. Welcome to download Bravo Novel app to read the full story of I Want a Lifetime with You novel online.